These guys always look like they're having a blast. Why not when you get to swim all day and eat fresh fish, right? North American river otters, also known as northern river otter or simply river otter, live in much of the North American continent along waterways and coastal areas. In Wyoming, you're more likely to view them in the northwestern portions of the state. Historically, northern river otter was distributed across most major river drainages in the U.S. and Canada, including much of Wyoming. Outside of Grand Teton and Yellowstone National Parks, the species had been extirpated from Wyoming in the mid-1900s due to over-trapping and habitat degradation. Protections of northern river otter in Wyoming outside of the national parks began in 1953 and remain in place today. Hunting and trapping of river otters in Wyoming is prohibited. While the species is now more widespread in the state, its exact distribution in Wyoming is still unclear. Northern River Otter is a large, stocky member of the weasel family, characterized by short legs with webbed feet, a long, tapered tail that makes up a third of its body, and a small, blunt head. Adult length ranges from 3 to 4 feet, and their weight can get up to 30 pounds. Northern River Otter habitat includes rivers, streams, marshes, lakes, and reservoirs with high water quality, riparian vegetation for cover, permanent open water for foraging, and ample food sources. River otter litters range from one to three young, born between February and April. They love to eat fish, from trout to whitefish, but will also eat crayfish and amphibians. While there are no robust estimates of numbers for river otter in Wyoming, the species is still considered rare. River otter populations are believed to be increasing in the state, in part due to dispersal from reintroduced populations in neighboring states. River otters tend to avoid areas of dense human populations, so it can be a treat to capture their playful nature with a camera. But don't approach. If you get a chance to see river otters up close, be sure to have a camera handy. Only a handful of adverse human otter encounters have been documented, Usually it's due to human encroachment upon their territory. This is Ray Hageman with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department.